Good morning. I am getting ready to run seven miles and I'm really looking forward to it. I am, uh, if you can see, there's some emergency vehicles back here. I don't know what's happening, but there's a bunch of fire trucks and I don't know if you can really see it. Uh, there's some kind of thing going on and the ocean police, which is a boat on a trailer, just came by. So I, I don't know what's going on. Maybe I'll find out on this run. But later on in this video, I would like to talk about two particular things. I'd like to talk about my vegetarian, vegan uh, experience or adventure and how that's going and what that means. And I'd also like to talk about some things I've learned about attitude this week. So I will see you in just a bit. So it's supposed to rain today. That's why I have a phone, I mean, a, I have a phone over my bag. I have a bag over my phone. Um, because it's supposed to rain, which it looks pretty stormy out there at sea and everything. But we'll see. So I'm about a mile and a half in. I'm talking quietly because I'm in a neighborhood and it's early and I don't want to wake people up. Although their windows Time, are probably closed minutes, because it's supposed to rain. Seconds. Distance two miles. Oh, I ran pace, two miles. 11 minutes, so what I wanted nine to talk about, per mile. remember how... Flip, pace, 11 minutes, six seconds per mile. And my pace is like 11 minutes or something right now. That's okay. Remember how last time I was kind of sad because I didn't get to run a long run. Guess what? I actually ran seven miles the next day on a Sunday afternoon. I ran seven miles, so I was really happy about that. But, let's see, was it that run? It might have been Monday. I can't remember which day. I've been running three miles every day except Tuesday when I work a really long shift, like 15 hours. But anyway, I was running like a three mile run and I had a really grouchy face. Part of it was I had taken a 15 minute nap and my contact, my contact lens were all dry. And so um, I had kind of a scowling face and the people who saw me were very negative to me, which was so interesting. Um, I'm really out of breath. Um, they, the first guy said, no wonder you have that look on your face. You should wear some shoes. That's the first thing that I got. Okay, so fast forward. Yesterday or the day before, I forget which, I went out and I wasn't feeling great, but I was feeling okay. And I had like four people say really positive things to me. Like, wow, barefoot running cool. And they even like complimented my clothes and it was like pretty cool. So whatever is on your face gets reflected back to you. And I'm going through a trial right now and I've noticed, even at work, if I pretend to be smiling and happy, even though I'm dying inside, it comes back to me as happiness. And so by just pretending to be happy, it actually helps me, if that makes sense. Um, look at this cute thing. Um, there's like, isn't that cute? The beach has a lot of really cool things. So anyway, what's on your face gets reflected back to you in other people. So I really love this stretch of my run. I love um, being around the boat. Um, I'm really interested in, in going out on boats and all of that. But anyway, I wanted to talk about my diet. So I decided just for a temporary period, um, and I'm using Lent as that period, but not necessarily for religious reasons, just because it kind of works out and other people are, you know, doing stuff like that too. So it kind of helps with the support and stuff. 
Anyway, I initially was thinking of being vegan, but I realized I take fish oil every day. Fish oil is really good for you. It, um, I use it for my dry eyes, and it's just, it's all the omega-3s are really good. So I take fish oil every day, so of course I can't be a vegan. And then I'm going along with that, you know, eating beans. I loved, I love beans. I love the diet. I love fruits and vegetables. Like I could be happy as a clam with just like a bowl of beans and some hot sauce. So I was doing that. But then I realized I wear wool every day, so I couldn't be a vegan. And so that was a problem. I, I kind of laughed when I realized, oh, vegans do not wear wool. But I, you know, in very freezing cold Southern California temperatures, I have to wear wool. I'm, I'm just joking. So, um, I've been eating more like a vegetarian diet. And I guess I'm allowing myself to eat fish also because I'm already taking the fish oil, so I might as well. Um, but vegan recipes are so, so good. You guys should try them. Really quick, before I end this, I want you to see, this is the Scarlet Bell. It's an old steamship that they um, fixed up and they have like a party harbor cruise. I forget what they're called, harbor cruise things. And then here are the island packers going out to the islands today. Um, we went out on a different vessel a couple weeks ago. Um, yeah, all the kayaks down there. So this is a really fun place to run. And I keep stopping because I'm looking at everything. So I've done uh, like five or six miles. I love being aware of smells on my runs. Um, of all the senses, like birds singing, those kinds of things. Time, and right one, back there, hour, three, when minute, I pass the hotel, ten seconds. Distance, um, five point it smells five like miles, pace, laundry. 11 minutes, and I really like seconds per the smell mile. of laundry. Split, pace, I love 11 doing laundry. Minutes, 40 I think there is laundry per mile. in my future. <laughs> 11 minutes. So I was going to run seconds, 7 miles, mile. Split, but I pace, found 12 this minutes, path and 40 seconds, I've decided I'm going to run 8 miles today. So I just finished 8 miles and I feel great. I'm so thankful that I got to do that. It's been a little while. Um, well, I ran 7 miles last Sunday. Um, I'm just grateful. That's all I feel right now is gratitude. Um, so in conclusion, um, ask yourself, what's on your face? Are you projecting a, I don't know if projecting is the right word, I need to look that up, but are you putting forth to the world a pleasant, happy face, no matter what you feel inside, and are you getting that back? And then my other question is, um, what's on your face? What are you eating? So, um, what's on my face is nice vegetarian food. It's not really a permanent thing, I don't think. I really like it, and I don't really care about meat, so I don't know, I'm having a good time with it. So, um, just uh, show happiness no matter what you're feeling, and have a great day.